Today, we're embarking on a fantastic voyage across the world's oceans, not in a tiny ship, but aboard the greatest naval marvels of our time. From the hulking aircraft carriers of the United States to the powerful destroyers of Russia, these ships aren't just feats of engineering, they're floating cities armed to the teeth with some of the most advanced technology known to man. Their sheer size and power are a testament to human ingenuity and the strategic importance of naval dominance, so buckle up as we set sail and discover the top 10 most advanced Navy battleships. The USS Gerald R. Ford, or CVN-78, is not just a marvel of modern engineering, but it also represents the future of naval power projection. Named after the 38th President of the United States, this aircraft carrier is the lead ship of her class and the first new US aircraft carrier design in over 40 years. The ship itself is a staggering 1,092 feet in length. That's about the size of three football fields. But it's not just the size that's impressive. The USS Gerald R. Ford introduces a variety of technological enhancements over the older Nimitz-class carriers. The most significant is the Electromagnetic Aircraft Launch System, or EMAILS. This replaces the old steam catapults, providing a more efficient, smoother and more adjustable launch of aircraft, improving the rate of launches and reducing wear and tear on the aircraft. Further, the ship incorporates new nuclear reactors that produce 250% more electrical power than their predecessors, which means it has the capacity to incorporate future systems like laser weapons, the Ford-class carriers also feature a new, smaller, faster-reacting radar system, an advanced arresting gear for landing aircraft, and a design that requires significantly fewer crew members. HMS Queen Elizabeth is not just a ship, but a statement of intent and a symbol of national ambition. It's the lead ship of the Queen Elizabeth class of aircraft carriers, the largest warships ever built for the Royal Navy of the United Kingdom, and the embodiment of a nation's naval heritage. At 932 feet in length and a displacement of 65,000 tons, the HMS Queen Elizabeth dwarfs all other warships in the Royal Navy's fleet. But again, it's not just the size that matters. The ship incorporates innovative technology, such as the ski jump ramp at the end of the runway that helps increase the payload or range of the aircraft being launched. Moreover, the ship is designed for a versatile range of operations, from humanitarian and disaster relief to fighting the wars of the future. It can accommodate up to 40 aircraft and is equipped with the highly advanced F-35B Lightning II stealth fighters and Merlin helicopters for airborne early warning and anti-submarine warfare. Perhaps most impressive is the ship's level of automation, which allows it to operate with a crew of only about 700 sailors, significantly fewer than comparable carriers in other navies. Its two gas turbine engines and four diesel engines can propel the ship at speeds in excess of 25 knots, all while carrying enough food and supplies to operate for up to seven months at sea without resupply. The INS Vikramaditya is not only a symbol of pride for the Indian Navy, but it's also a testament to the power of engineering and technological innovation. This aircraft carrier, once the Russian ship Admiral Gorshkov, underwent an extensive and complicated refurbishment to be transformed into the flagship of the Indian Navy. At a length of 930 feet and displacement of 45,400 tons, INS Vikramaditya is smaller than the USS Gerald R. Ford and the HMS Queen Elizabeth, but it's a crucial component of the Indian Navy's Blue Water capabilities. The ship has the capacity to carry over 30 aircraft, including the MiG-29K fighter jet and various types of helicopters. The carrier is also equipped with advanced sensors, including the long-range air surveillance radars and advanced electronic warfare suites that can detect and track incoming threats. Furthermore, the ship is powered by eight new-generation boilers, which makes it capable of reaching speeds of over 30 knots. When we talk about the most advanced Navy ships, we cannot ignore the Aegis destroyers, known for their high-tech combat system. Named after Aegis, the shield of the Greek god Zeus, these ships provide the backbone of modern naval defense for several nations, including the United States, Japan, South Korea, and Spain. The Aegis combat system, from which the ships get their name, is a centralized, automated command and control weapons control system that uses powerful computers and radars to track and guide weapons to destroy enemy targets. The system's SBI-1 radar is amongst the most advanced and powerful naval radars in the world, 
capable of performing search, track and missile guidance functions simultaneously, with a track capacity of over 100 targets. These destroyers are armed with a range of weapons, including anti-air, anti-surface and anti-submarine warfare systems. They also have the capability to engage ballistic missiles, enhancing their role in defense. The American Ali Burke class, the Japanese Atago class and the South Korean Sejong the Great class are among the most well-known Aegis destroyers. These are not just ships, they are a comprehensive and highly adaptable combat system, capable of dealing with multiple simultaneous threats in all warfare areas. They are the true watchful eyes of the sea, always vigilant against potential threats. The Zumwalt class destroyers represent the next generation of naval warfare. These US Navy vessels incorporate the latest technology to redefine what a destroyer is capable of. It's not just about size or firepower, it's about utilizing cutting-edge tech to create a truly futuristic vessel. The stealth capabilities of the Zumwalt class are unprecedented. Its unique tumble-home hull design, where the hull slopes inward above the waterline, reduces its radar cross-section, making it harder to detect. Add to that the advanced multifunction radar system, and it's clear that this vessel is built for stealth. However, stealth doesn't mean it's lacking in firepower. On board is the advanced gun system, which can launch rocket-assisted, precision-guided projectiles up to 63 nautical miles. Future plans include installing electromagnetic railguns, weapons that use magnetic fields rather than explosives, to launch projectiles at high speeds. The Zumwalt class also boasts integrated power systems that provide electricity to all the ship's systems, making it possible to incorporate advanced weapons and sensors. The Admiral Gorshkov class, or Project 2, 2350, is Russia's latest and most advanced class of frigates, symbolizing the renaissance of the Russian Navy's surface combatant fleet. The frigate represents a balanced naval platform, smaller than a destroyer but larger than a corvette, providing both offensive and defensive capabilities. Despite being classified as a frigate, the Admiral Gorshkov class is armed to the teeth. The ship carries the potent P-800 Onyx and Kaliber cruise missiles, known for their range and precision. These can be used against naval or land targets, giving the Admiral Gorshkov class a long reach. Additionally, the ship has advanced air defense systems, including the Parliament Redut system, similar to the Aegis system. The Redut system can track and engage multiple aerial targets simultaneously, from aircraft to cruise and ballistic missiles. The Admiral Gorshkov class is designed to be stealthy, with a reduced radar cross-section and thermal signature. In addition, the ship is equipped with advanced electronic warfare systems and decoys to confuse enemy radars and missiles. China's Type 055 destroyer, also known as the Renhai class, represents the latest leap in the People's Liberation Army Navy's technological development. This class of guided missile destroyers is one of the largest and most powerful surface combatants currently in operation in the world. The Renhai class has a displacement of about 13,000 tons and spans an impressive 180 meters in length. This massive vessel can sustain high-speed operations across vast distances, serving China's strategic ambitions across the Asia-Pacific region. In terms of weaponry, the Renhai class is armed with a potent mix of anti-air, anti-ship and anti-submarine missiles. The most noteworthy is the YJ-18 anti-ship cruise missile, known for its supersonic terminal speed, making it challenging for enemy defenses to intercept. Beyond its impressive arsenal, the Renhai class features cutting-edge radar systems that can detect and track multiple targets concurrently, from aircraft to missile threats. These destroyers can function as a fleet's protective shield while also packing a substantial offensive punch. The FREM, Frigate European Multi-Mission class, represents a joint venture between France and Italy to develop a new class of frigates that can handle a variety of tasks from anti-aircraft warfare to anti-submarine operations. This European project is a clear demonstration of the benefits of cooperative efforts in defense. It reflects the shared vision, standards, and technological capabilities of two of Europe's biggest naval powers. In terms of weaponry, the Fremem frigates come equipped with an array of missile systems for a variety of tasks. This includes Aster surface-to-air missiles and Exocet anti-ship missiles. Italian variants also feature the Tessio MK2-E, an anti-ship and land attack missile. 
Frem frigates also incorporate advanced sensor suites, including a state-of-the-art radar system capable of detecting and tracking multiple targets. This allows the frigate to respond effectively to threats in real time. These vessels are also equipped for anti-submarine warfare, featuring low-frequency towed sonar arrays and MU-90 torpedoes. It's these capabilities that make the Frem a truly multi-mission frigate, capable of dealing with a broad range of threats and tasks. Japan's Izumo-class helicopter destroyers are a class of ships that blur the line between destroyer and aircraft carrier. They represent Japan's largest warships since World War II. Though they are officially classified as helicopter destroyers, their flat deck design and large displacement, 27,000 tons, give them the appearance of miniature aircraft carriers. The Izumo-class ships are 248 meters long and carry up to 14 helicopters. They have been designed for anti-submarine warfare and can quickly deploy helicopters to track and neutralize submarine threats. The ships also have the capacity to support amphibious operations, humanitarian aid, and disaster relief missions. The Izumo's primary armament is its squadron of SH-60K anti-submarine helicopters. They also carry anti-surface and anti-aircraft weapons for self-defense, including the Phalanx Close-In Weapon System CIWS, and the CRAM Missile System. What makes Izumo unique, however, is that it could potentially operate short takeoff and vertical landing aircraft. Although Japan's constitution prohibits offensive military capability, the potential capability of Izumo to operate such aircraft is significant. The USS Missouri, affectionately known as the Mighty Mo, is an Iowa-class battleship that served in the United States Navy from World War II through the Gulf War. It was the site of the surrender of the Empire of Japan, marking the end of World War II. At the time of its construction, the USS Missouri was a marvel of technology. It had a displacement of over 45,000 tons and measured over 270 meters in length. This vessel was equipped with nine 16-inch guns, each capable of launching a projectile over 20 miles. For defense against air attack, the Missouri was originally equipped with dozens of anti-aircraft guns. These were later supplemented and then replaced with missile systems as technology progressed. Despite having been decommissioned in 1992, the USS Missouri remains a symbol of American naval power. It now serves as a museum ship at Pearl Harbor, allowing visitors to step back in time and experience a piece of naval history. Its advanced design for the time, combined with the critical role it played in historic events, earns the USS Missouri a place in our list. I hope you enjoyed our top 10 list of advanced battleships today. Please let us know any ideas you'd like to see be turned into future videos down below.